it'll be an opportunity for the Saints. Penalty coming up to Sherwood Park. Honeskew hasn't noticed yet as they break in and they score! Teo Pisani with a man all over him puts it through on the delayed penalty and there's your great start, Wokey. What a nifty move by Pisani. The Saints drew that penalty on the rush coming up the ice in their own zone. McNally sees Pisani and what a move there by Pisani to dip that one through Carter Davis. And then the patience to get around Eric Roos as we have another look at it, but an excellent move to go through the triangle of Davis. The Shaders take over and here's Davis back at the point. Shot through, tipped and they score. Uh, the deflection at the side of the net from Hauer. And we are tied at one. Yeah, inability to clear a puck out there. Wyatt Davis ends up finding that puck in the middle of the ice. Right on the blue line, has all day to get rid of the shot. To Souch in, they try to move it into the slot area and kicked out by Oneskew. Another great save by the goaltender. And he gets across to the left side to make another terrific save. And... The Saints getting the goaltending they need to get back and take this lead. Good job on the goaltender to be patient. I love that first save with the right pad too. Such a quick shot. And the Crusaders unable to get it out because this forecheck from Spruce Grove is so steady. And now it's in front, Kirkpatrick, the back and scores! Pardon me, Teo Pisani again with the backhand shelf. And oh wow, what a start for Teo as he has two. Bassani's second multi-goal game of the season and just some excellent work on the four check as the Saints do exactly what the Crusaders did to them earlier on in the first period. And what a finish, what a set of mitts here by Bassani. Takes out one in the midsection. Quick little house she going forehand, backhand up over the right pad. Puts it wide, it was deflected. Now they send it out. And the Crusaders, Noah Wills, shorthanded. Bothered there by Dawkins, penalty coming up, or will it be a penalty shot? It is! The first ever AJHL penalty shot at the Silent Ice Center. Diego Johnson on the showdown over the blue line, coming in on the backhand, and Oneskew makes the stop with the blocker, getting it across, and the goaltender shuts the door again here at Silent Ice Center. Yeah, Oneskew continues to stand tall. Outside of Pisani, he's been the best player on the ice. Hey, Magarel jumps on the rebound, but that was blocked before it could get through. Penalty is over now, and the Crusaders coming in on the attack, and Oneskew stretches out, but they put it in at the side of the net. Ethan Murner taps it in. Not much the goaltender could do about that rebound. Pretty easy one there, and that's just the inability, the power play to take advantage of the opportunity. You allow a team like the Crusaders to stick around and take three penalties in a period and not really create anything out of them. And just an excellent net drive right there. The Crusaders gets it to Davis, back to Ringor over the blue line. And Larkin gets a stick in there, but Ringor kept it going. And there's a shot on net by Davis and Oneskew reaches out and makes a nice glove save. And now we get a little emotion in front of the net there. The first time we've seen really any of this tonight. The perimeter, good job by the Saints PK to keep them outside. Yeah, the Crusaders getting a little bit closer on the Friesen brothers. Shot clock as they score in front. It is Hunter Price. And the Crusaders take a 3-2 lead. Set play off the face off there. And Price finds himself all alone in front of the net. An excellent job by the Crusaders here. Little... D down drive, excellent pass there down the wall, from down the wall by Gengel. Price all alone right in front of Oneskew. All right, two seconds to go. Puck is dropped, Dawkins backhands it towards the net. Time runs out and the Crusaders come back as we get some pushing and shoving. McNelly was in a headlock in front of the net, so this one not done yet, even though the buzzer is gone. Yeah, the Saints score early, but unable to hold on here tonight as the Crusaders take it three to two. 